All right, let's see what voltages we get on our digital multimeter when we read the voltages across the two resistors. So I'm going to put my digital multimeter on volts DC, this one. It's a little different than the ones I've been use, having you use in class, but it's similar to the digital multimeters you've been using in my class. So now we're on uh, volts DC, and I have my two probes here, and I'm going to try to place them across one of the resistors. And if everything is working, it should read about 1.25 volts. And if you look, the, re the voltage across the top resistor is 1.26 volts, so just about perfect. And then the other 1.26 volts, the other half of the 2.5 volt voltage, should occur across this one, the second resistor. And if you look, sure enough, 1.255, nearly perfect. So half the voltage is appearing across the first resistor, the other half of the voltage is occurring across the second resistor. The two voltages add to 2.5 volts, so it appears the pulse width modulation uh, is, is working as long as I'm measuring with this digital multimeter. But we're going to see something funny happen when we try to measure with the red board itself. Okay, very good.